Welcome to my video. To get new educational videos and updates, please subscribe to my channel. I'd be very grateful if you could please like and share this video, which I hope will give you a beneficial knowledge. This is a 56 year old lawyer developed posterior capsule opacification in both eyes two years after premium multifocal IOL insertion and he is having blurred vision in the near and far and very unhappy and during examination we can see the posterior capsule opacification in the center with retro elimination here and high magnification you can see the diffractive rings of the multifocal intraocular lens with the posterior capsule opacification with direct and retro elimination the young machine setting one pulse power three millijoules defocus 300 microns and lower the aiming beam the counseling of the patient it has to be six months after cataract surgery and warn them about floaters for a long time pre laser you have to give topical anesthetic and apracrinidine to avoid rise of the pressure in my opinion the easiest way to do an opening in the posterior capsule is by doing a crochet opening like this one so you start at 12 o'clock and go down so you avoid beating of the um, intraocular lens till 6 o'clock and then you will have an opening um, in the center then we will enlarge it on both sides from the center to the periphery so you will have at the end a diamond shaped opening and this is helping the uh, visual axis not to have any flaps like the circular technique we start at 12 o'clock in the upper part of the capsule and you can see the aiming beam with lower intensity and I'm not using any uh, contact lens the patient is cooperative and then you go down to complete the vertical limp of the crochet technique and avoid pitting of the lens so damage of the multifocal lens will reduce the efficiency of the multifocality of the lens so you have to be sure of the focus and as I advise to make the aiming beam as low as possible so we finish the vertical limb of the crochet and then we're going to do the sides from the center to the periphery then the other side from the center to the periphery and always make sure you are focused on the capsule and you can see here that after finishing this side you will have the diamond shaped opening and it is wide so this is what we aim still little part here on this side so this is post operative and you can give some steroid drops uh, four times for two weeks 
in diabetics and retinal pathology. Now the patient is happy, the vision is 6-6 and the near vision is N5. So now I can sleep well. Remember the three secrets in multifocal IOL, crochet technique, big diamond shape, procedure defocus, lower the aiming beam and thank you very much for watching.